We're looking at the new Cadillac XTS. It is the highest end luxury sedan for the brand and the man who's gonna make sense of it all. Tell us how it came to be and what it is is Don Butler, Vice President of Marketing for Cadillac. Beautiful car. What is the, who's the audience for this car? Let's start with this. This is your highest end Cadillac. Correct, correct. For us, XTS represents the new definition of a large luxury sedan for Cadillac, and we needed to contemporize the design. Uh, we needed to make it more modern, more fresh, and so we've done that from the standpoint of the styling on the exterior with things like LED signature lighting that uh, has a vertical kind of lamp signature for us that identifies it as, a, as a Cadillac adaptive forward headlighting. And the other thing that we've done as well with the vehicle is that there's a huge emphasis on technology within the XTS and technology that's meaningful, that's purposeful for our consumers. Both so inside the car and outside the car. Inside the car and outside the car. Let's talk Absolutely. about some of that on the outside. I mean, you have sure. these sensors. Security is a big issue with, with this car and in mm -hmm. terms of what it can sense going around you, whether you're going to be in a crash. Tell us how that works. Yeah, and so with XTS, we'll be offering a system that is basically all-encompassing in terms of a 3 360 degree view of the surrounding environment of the vehicle and so we have forward radar we have forward cameras actually you get a warning um, and in, the, in this case it's a very uh, unique industry first type of warning today's warning systems typically are bells yeah. or buzzers hear, hear or yeah, going, right. or just maybe a light and so we actually have an industry first the safety alert seat we actually have a seat that vibrates I'm going to drive right out of here. You're all right with that. You know, Absolutely. You don't need this car. <laughs> now, the heart of the technology system is right here. You call it Q? Right. Q stands for Cadillac User Experience. Okay. And really, the way to think about this is as a tablet for the vehicle. So there's a capacitive touch screen interface. Like an iPad. Like an iPad, large icons, and even the gestures that you'd use on a tablet. So sweeping, pinching, sliding, selecting by touching. Those are exactly the same gestures that you'd use with Q for Cadillac user experience. Would you be doing internet surfing? Would you do your music here? What all would you control from here? Uh, not internet surfing no. because we want you concentrating on the driving. That was a Careful. test. <laughs> that was a test, Don. You passed that test. The other thing that's really cool about Q is we have what we call natural voice recognition natural language voice recognition so that means if you're familiar with voice rec systems today you have to step through a complicated series of menus so you might say music artist black keys right right, right. with Q you can simply say I'd like to listen to the black keys or it just immediately is it in, recognizes not it just recognize your voice, anybody's voice, anybody's right. voice or play something by the black keys we have a broad contextual awareness but we concentrated in three categories, and that's why we're able to do natural language recognition. And so the things that are most um, useful in terms of natural language are obviously phone calls, right? That t definitely makes total sense. Okay. So the second thing is navigation. So you'd be able to say, uh, I'd like to go to the Javits Center. I'm and going somewhere more cool than the Javits Center. <laughs> okay. Come on. I'd like to go to the Bahamas. Take me to the airport. 